839 on this Wednesday. Time to start making your holiday wish list. Homemade soaps and beauty products are a great gift idea. And there's one place in the valley that specializes in those hand soaps. And the products are all cruelty free. It is called Strawberry Hedgehog. And it's one of Jamie's local loves. Good morning, Jamie. Hey, guys. Good morning. They have all kinds of great things like these cool glasses for you to buy here at Strawberry Hedgehog. And uh, I mean, you can smell this place from around the corner. So I'm on uh, 15th Avenue and Thomas sitting right here. You can tell this building because it has all the beautiful lights here and it is just gorgeous inside and so fragrant. So I want to introduce you to uh, the lady behind the soaps here, our dear friend Tracy. And Tracy, uh, you know, it was kind of a health reason that you came to make these soaps and now they just have been uh, uh, flying off the shelves. Tell me first of all how this all came to be. Sure. So I started making products in 2003 just for myself because I was having issues with conventional products and I had such great luck. I wasn't having bad reactions to what I made and by 2007 it was going well enough that I made it an official business. Now we have to mention you're in Whole Foods which is yeah it makes you very official. Yes thank you. That I'm, must feel so good. It feels amazing and uh, I got in in 2009 at Whole Foods and so it's been eight years now of uh, wonderful exposure and relationships with everybody at Whole Foods. Um, so I love it. I'm very lucky. So how many different varieties of soaps do you have? Oh my goodness. Too many to count. Too many to count. Many to but count. you have a favorite. I expected you to say, oh, I don't know, my baby. <laughs> uh, but you had a favorite right away. And that I do, one. yes. The eucalyptus lime is my favorite. Uh -huh. uh, I've been making that one since the beginning. So I, you know, it's kind of near and dear. Where it's, is it? It's near and dear. Straight ahead. Let's see. I'm going to grab this one. Tree in my garden, oh, wow. and um, it smells like the spa. That's why. Look at that! I love all. it. I, love <laughs> it. <laughs> I said that before you. I even knew yep. you were going to say the spa <laughs> thing. Okay, so let's go back here because we want to show the folks how you make these things. Uh, you you have a great Instagram account, first oh, of all, for you. watching what you slice oh, uh, for you. Phoenix Flea. I'll show you a little preview in a second. Mm -hmm. But show me how you make this. Sure. So first, I I whip it up in a. In, usually in a gigantic pot. I do about 40 pounds at a time. Um, but uh, I pour it into a mold. I do several layers and then I uh, have to let it sit for about 24 hours and then unmold it. Release the release soap. The, release the hounds. <laughs> yes, release the soap. Mm -hmm. So uh, it's kind of like getting ice out of an ice cube yeah. tray. It's not, uh, not terribly so. graceful, but there we go. Um, and I will show you, after I get this out, okay. if you like, I can show you how to slice it. Oh, and then yeah. I've got another batch. I wanted to make something special just with you. Oh, my goodness. So, so I've got some ingredients to make a candy cane soap. Oh, uh, how cool. Okay, can we take a slice right, oh, right now, sure. or do we want to wait? Yeah, let's take okay. a slice. This is the ginger peach. Okay, the ginger peach. Okay. She's going to grab the slicer. Oh, I can't wait to see this. Okay, where's the best angle? Should we have a Ricky yeah. over here or over up here? Right, right here. here. Okay. All right. So, what is so fun about slicing the soap is that every time the pattern is a little bit different, yeah. and so you have no idea. I, you know, I've been making these for years and years, and every time it's different. And how much for a bar of soap? Uh, each bar of soap is ten dollars, okay. or we have a sale going most of the time. Honestly, three for twenty-five. Oh wow! It's great gifts. And then Tracy cuts every single bar that comes out of here herself. Oh, yes. uh, so this is near and dear to the heart. Okay, real quick before I let you go, I want to tell you about the body creams that she has. So we're going to talk about that 945. Phoenix Flea, my friends, is on Saturday at Heritage Square. Look, this is a Phoenix Flea only soap. How cute is that? That is perfect for your friends and family who maybe do not live here anymore or the ones who do. Uh, so again, you know, it's shop local at Small Business Saturday this Saturday. You know I have to talk about that. But it's called Strawberry Hedgehog. We're right here at 15th Ave and Thomas. Come on down and see Tracy. Great place. And 945, we're going to uh, make some uh, whipped creams and such for the body and learn more about that. Back to you guys. It's a great store. Really cute. Really Thank nice. you, Jamie.